and we can give traction. The position of the forearm can be adjusted by rotating on either side. The side where it has the maximum curvature. So accordingly, I'll bend. So this is the nail I have seen. Distal epiphysis, about half a centimeter above, with a Two point five millimeter L wire. The nail by ninety degree into the proximal canal. As the fracture is in the distal third, the maximum curvature I am giving. On the radial side. I am taking a small incision. This is again the cobbler's owl, and so that I am going into the ulnar canal. Shoot. Again, I'll rotate the nail. You can see that you can see here how the intraosseous membrane gets stretched, and the excess length. Now the excess length of the nail. Is this is the bender. A small bend is given at the tip of the nail. tip of the nail with a good grip and thing of the measured and cut to hold the nail for removal This is the single stitch at the dorsolateral radial entry. I am fully supinating. Flex the wrist and give a thumb. Now we are given a above.